Mm, before? Miss. Hey, you say? Hey, you're cheating again. Are you sure about it, man? How can you tell? You're looking at Sully's reflection. No, I'm not. Ugh. What is Sully doing here anyway? I'm just watching the Pentagon wait lift until it press others. Well then, watch him somewhere else. Raystone, just because I'm looking at Sally's reflection doesn't mean I'm cheating. Well, doesn't it count as cheating? No. But it says in the rules, in the instructions. Look, rule 13, do not play the game with the reflection behind the other player, but is an unfair advantage and counts as cheating. Why is the mayor considered a Because it's, you know, a part of the rules? I'm good. Hey, uh, Satellite, do you hear that? No, what is it? I think Redstone groaned or something. Oh, he must be playing a board game with someone. How can you tell? Because we're five feet away from them. Wait, how the hell- Hey, Red Team, can you all hurry up? We're going to have the elimination in about two minutes. Okay. Can you not cheat again, please? It really ruins the game. Can you play it not cheat? Stop it! Welcome to the Elimination Area contestants, seems like you had no knowledge or time on fixing arcade machine. We did have that, it was just too difficult. Didn't ask you. Anyways, I have some very good news since we got 44 votes. A brand new record for our show. And this time, nobody is safe with 0 or 1 vote. And also, I bought the new crowd area with my bank account. Alright, no more being around the bush. Let's get to the votes. Rose, you are the first one safe with only two votes. Nice! What's my prize? Your prize is, uh... Uh... Hold on, give me a minute to think about it. Right, the prizes for today's elimination are floppy disks. Really? Floppy disks? Yes. Anyway, Rose, here's your prize. The next two safe ones are Selly and Butter, respectively, with three votes each. Nice! Uh, not again. uh, we will fix you once the elimination is over. Anyways, Cactus, even though you have little to no knowledge of fixing machines, you are safe with only four votes. It's down to the bottom four, Pentagon, Chair, Spindrift, and Redstone. And let's look at the reasons why the viewers voted for the following contestants. Pentagon, Mark 1 and Bacon on YouTube says, E, Pentagon bad, he almost killed RK Machine, he a bad boy. If he actually was able to have more space, we would have already won. Whatever, you still made your team lose the challenge. Okay, and- Just shut up already, you're actually getting annoying. Okay, sorry, that was a bit rude. Moving on to chair, we couldn't really find the comments for this one because I got them from another source. But the viewers say you don't get enough screen time and you barely get any lines. Oh, is it really that bad? Whoa, we will have guessed. Yes, yes it is. Where do you get those claims anyway? That's secret information, sorry. It's from our official Discord server down in the description. Join now if you want to meet the crew and be updated on the IB related news. Whatever. Redstone, the viewers say you did nearly nothing last episode and that's it. That's it? That's such a petty reason! 
how do you find it petty at all? You just found a toolbox and that's just it. As for you, spin drift. The viewers say you are boring, bland and don't get enough screen time. Bland? Boring? Who even finds me boring? I just fly and hover! Well, what else can you do? Okay, you got me there. Alright, we are done with the comments. Let's get to the votes. Chair, you are safe with 5 votes, and so is Pentagon, who also has 5 votes. Ah. Bottom 2, Spindrift and Redstone. Who will get the last disc and who will get the boot? Let's see the votes. Redstone, with only a 10 vote difference, you are safe with 6 votes, which means Spindrift is out with 16 votes. Sorry Spindrift, good luck in the next season. I have no idea. He probably is a bit more entertaining than you. This is absolutely outrageous! Okay, shut up. Charger, do your thing. I am not going anywhere! You are here. Yes, yes, I am- OH MY GOD, WHAT HAPPENED TO THESE GUYS?! I don't know. It's been two years since they were here. I think they had no potatoes to eat. I... I don't know what to say. I, I had no words. How's that gonna host that thing up then? We need to do something or something! So today's challenge... Hello? Yo! Excuse me, who are you? Don't talk with me like that! I'm here to inform you that there will be a portal on the mainland you're in in the next few seconds. I'm sorry, what? Whoa! Guess who? Sorry, who are you? Oh, I'll wait to explain. And that's my intro thought. Okay then. Anyways, I'm here to do something I was waiting for to do for a long time. Please don't say you're gonna steal this show. Nope. Why would I? Even though I did, I'll pretty much keep the show as it is. So, why are you here exactly? I'll explain to you right about now. Oh, why cone? What is this place anyway? Stupid dog! Oh. It's this kind of episode. Yep, crossovers, man. Alrighty then. At least it isn't with Battle for the Win. Bloody hell! Every show I cross over with gets cancelled after one or two episodes! Laptop? I got a request to cross over with Inanimate Brawl. Let's not. Okay then. See you soon, boss. Ah! <sighs> when did the rainbow fade? Alright you two, quit arguing and go anyway, cause it's time for the seventh challenge! Can I suggest it? Sure. Hmm, I guess that will do then. So, are you gonna tell us the challenge, or leave us hanging here? Dude, let him announce the challenge! Shut up, nobody asked you! You just did! SHUT IT! Alright. Let me say it. So your challenge is to be friends with the contestants from Competition from the Bucks. The team that makes more friends than the other team will get immunity, while the other one will say bye bye to one of its members. Go! So what? Were we just make friends with these guys? I guess so. Uh, okay, let me talk to that guy over there. Hi, I'm Redstone. And you? Oh hey! I'm safe, and this is my friend Compass. Hey man! Nice to meet both of you. Wanna be friends? Sure thing! Hey, is it okay if me and Magnet sit here with you? Uh, I guess. So, 
What are you thinking about, Arcade Machine? I, I don't know. After the life challenge, I start to feel like I should change my design. Hmm. And what should your new design look like? Something that doesn't make me look like a stolen character, you know? Do you remember that one up to show with the flag, chicken, or whatever? Yeah. What about it? Well, look at this. That's you. Yes, and I'm tired of people calling me out a machine from Brawl of the Arctic and claiming that I'm somehow brought back to life by some wizard or something. Backpack, can you do something about it? I guess, Harkad, do you want to change your design or do something original? Yeah, but I do. Alright. <laughs> And voila! You're no longer some stolen character. You're on a Handgun. Mm, I like this. Dude, what are you doing with these two guys? Oh my lord! Why do you look so good? I know. Backpack helped me with making a new design. Man, I can't believe I'm actually being nice for once. <laughs> but I still hate it. <laughs> Hey, I see rust on it. Mind if we paint it? No. Oh, come on. It wouldn't be that bad. Did I stutter? I don't want it! God! First the hot mustard and now paint? You know what? You're living. Let's go. Find another good person, Magnet. I know! You can't do want any tips? I got 25 cents! Okay. Thank you. You can thank me later! Oof! Hey, watch it, bud! Sorry, but do you at least want to be friends? Hmm. You are red and tall. Aha! <laughs> I got an idea. Go on, follow me! Uh, all right. Here, as you see, we do a humongous amount of crimes. How were you guys not in jail? That's a great question. We actually ran away from the cops. Anyway, meet my friends. The Vandalizer, Rubberhead, Bone Slicer, Class Ring, Smoker, The Circle of Death, Gosh, Finance, Gambler Abdict Ace, and The Fisherman. Oh. And also, there's the little girl candy corn, but we call her the finger bleeder. Why exactly the finger bleeder? <coughs> Ow! That's why. She likes to bite fingers every day. Okay. You guys know where is Rose? Not sure. <coughs> Hold on. What was that? Well, I can recognize people's voices. It is clearly Stim's screaming. Why would she scream? I don't know. We need your help! You know, I have a feeling that she needs help. Let's all go to Jupiter to see if she's okay. Alright, PC. Okay. Alright, what seems to be the problem, Spindrift? It's best not to know. Just tell me. You can't film me forever. All of the eliminated contestants except us died. Huh, this should be easy to fix. We just need to recover them. PC, do the command. I can't recover eliminated contestants. Oh. Well then, uh, we need to go back to Earth, and I will do it. Snorp and Spindra, you get the rest of the eliminated contestants in this queue. PC, teleport yourself and Charger onto the mainland. Mm -hmm. 